Hello friends and welcome back. Well, what a difference a day makes, my goodness. It is cool today, but oh, the sun is out. That's all that I care about. I decided to bring my pansies outside here uh, to get a little bit of sunshine. I don't trust them outside 100% yet, but uh, I think real soon. So I'm gonna let them have a little time in the sunshine and then I will bring them back in the house. But while I was out here, here's an interesting tidbit. Right here, where I have this little birdhouse, right here, I had one of those long bird feeders that is squirrel proof and blah, blah, blah. I came out here, it's gone. I have no idea where it is as I'm looking here. I'm gonna take my suet feeder in, but, um, now I have my suspicions, of course. I do think possibly a bear, but I don't see any prints here. No paw prints at all. So I don't know, but the suet feeder's coming in and I noticed I have some little bulbs coming up. Those are hyacinths there. And then as I'm walking around the yard, the blue squill have popped up. It's amazing, my goodness. Just a week ago, we had snow. So these are my favorite. I love them. They smell almost like a grape hyacinth. They're so pretty. I always pick them and bring them inside. They're so pretty that I decided to try planting some bulbs last year. And look, they've come up. So I'm quite excited about that. I'm anxious to see those pop and see what happens. I am also noticing we lost, lost the top of that tree right there. And here it is, down on the ground. Ugh. We had some high winds, and I'm just hoping my lilacs make it this year. I was out here pounding those so they weren't bent over, but hopefully everything will be okay. So in today's video, I'm rather excited. Yesterday was a very rainy day, so I decided to take a trip to Vermont. Let me preface by saying one of my favorite things about New England is all of the fun general stores. So I decided to take a ride to Vermont yesterday to a part of Vermont that I've never been. And I did a little bit of research just looking up general stores in that area and there were quite a few. It's just amazing to me how there are so many general stores or country stores throughout New England and they're all so different. And I can honestly say a couple of these I'm adding to my favorites list. And I have shared some with you in previous videos. If you missed those, I will link those below because I have shared some uh, other general stores in Vermont, Maine, New Hampshire. Um, I don't think I've done videos on any others. I've been to plenty <laughs> because like I said, if I see the sign, I'm pulling in. So I hope you enjoyed today's video, friends. It's a fun one. We get out and about even though it is raining. And, um, but look, there are signs of spring. So I'm going to let you enjoy a day of shopping at the general stores while I get out here and I start some raking. Okay, let's get started.
Now, before you go, I just wanted to say thank you so much for participating in last week's video and leaving such wonderful comments. I truly had so much fun reading everyone's and learning a little bit about each of you. So once again, thank you. And I also loved that you were conversing amongst yourselves. We are a community here and it's fun to learn a little bit about each other. So thanks again. Have a wonderful week, my friends, and we will see you next time. Bye-bye.